Okay, so this is going to be a Timu haul. I do have a couple orders together, but here's one bag. Um, here's another one, which this only had five items in it. Get my glasses on so I can see. And we're going to get started here because I have some really cool things here. And if you're new to my channel, thank you for finding me because I know it's not easy. You have a field of other haulers, reviewers that are doing all the same thing I'm doing. And um, you have choices. So I thank you for finding me. I thank you to the followers who keep coming back and watching. Um, and so this one we'll get into here. So this is a fun one here, I think. So we're going to open this one up here. Lots of fun things here. And you can see I'm in my travel trailer studio, but I am an influencer on Timu now. So I did just get some recent seeding money. So that's all, you know what that, how that works? So let me tell you, this whole thing I'm gonna show you today is all paid for by my money. It's not the promotion. It's not through um, the influencer program. But with the influencer program, if you have followers, I'm gonna put all the information below. If you have a following and you haven't become an influencer yet through the Timu program, why not try it? You get, what you do is you get money, you get credits based on your videos, based on um, your followers and how many clicks they hit here and there. And then that grows throughout the period they have campaigns. I think it's every quarter, or every couple of months and it starts over. And so based on that, that's how you, how much you earn in seeding money. And then you get to th go through. Now, the first time I did it, um, it was like $50 and they just let me, I didn't know the program very well. So I just selected what was in the first shot, but there's actually a search bar and you can search out whatever you want. So if you have something in your cart and you wanted to really try it and you don't know it yet, then go ahead and do that um, through the seating and influencer program. So I don't get anything for it. I just get the seating money to make other choices for maybe something you're looking at. And if you put something in the comments, I can I can make that part of my influencing purchase under the Timu program. And um, that way it's a win-win. I get to review it. I don't have to, it doesn't cost me anything. And you get to see it here and get an honest review because I, they don't care. You give an honest review. It doesn't, it's not based on whether or not you agree with them or not. So it's not that kind of a program. And um, why not do it that way? So you know people have different opinions on it. So let me just start here. Okay, so these are, I love these. And so this is my second or third time buying them. I don't know if I've ever reviewed them on here before, but this is a four piece texture, <laughs> butt lifting brief. Um, so you get four of them for $6.69. And they come with four different colors. It's multicolor. You get, so I got some different colors this time. So like a nude, uh, I don't know, tan, a pinkish, peach, and a black pair. But I really like these. Um, they kind of like have this wide panel and they don't roll. They do not roll. It's it's a little bit more stretchy. Um, I don't know if it lifts my butt, but I do like them. They wash up well, they don't shrink. Um, breathable, because they do have the cotton um, insert on the crotch area. And yeah, so I do recommend these. I, I do because I bought them three times now. This is my third purchase. So I think I'm good on underwear for a while. But anyway, $6.69 for four pair. And what I liked about them is if you're wearing a dress or a summer dress, um, back in the old days, <laughs> we wore pantyhose. So that would always like l hold you in place. That's what this does without having the pantyhose feel. So they work great. I like them. So then I got, what is this? Oh, okay. So this is cool. I haven't tried these before. Let's see how we like them, everybody. So this is a three pack crew neck tank top. Six seventy-seven. Now I have bought some before. I like them. They're a little shorter, and um, I wore them under my um, shorts overalls, but they still kind of pull up. So I wanted something a little longer. Uh oh. <laughs> I don't think I got it with this order, unless they they come down. Yeah, they seem a little short too. So I'm gonna have to let you know. They're much longer than the crop ones I have though. Oh, that's good. Okay. So we'll see. For six seventy-seven, I'm still gonna wear them. Um, so I got in this three pack for six seventy seven, I said, um, and that's what I paid. I'll have all the other, you know, I always do the picture insert. I always put everything in the description box below. And I like this color. It's kind of like an olive green. It's actually brighter than olive and the fabric. It's super soft. I've come across this before where, you know, they all say pretty much polyester with maybe a blend of cotton here and there, but one polyester compared to another polyester, um, seems to be a little bit different from Timu. Anyway, these have a soft, soft feel to them. I don't know if you can see in the picture. This shirt is a Timu. It doesn't feel the same. This feels more cottony. Um, and then the white one. 
and definitely lots of stretch to it. So I do like that. So, oh, so I wanted to try these because my old ones, I got two of these. I did not know they were gonna be in here. Um, they sit down on the ground, but when you're mopping and everything, this is gonna be great because I'm gonna get this off the ground and I'll be able to move my mop there without having to move it. this, even though I take everything out of the bathroom anyway, but still. So let's see what this is gonna look like. Excuse me, I dropped it. So what's nice is it has like a little brush here if you need to scrub around the toilet. Um, it's got a sticky pad here, double-sided. Um, I, I don't know if that's gonna hold much, but I did get some 3M uh, tape rounds, so I like that. So there's no bottom to this, it's open. So that's gonna make kind of a mess on the bottom. I don't know why I did that. Um, hmm. I guess, oh, and, and that's a silicone top. So how strong is that on there? Because I get a little ferocious when I'm cleaning that toilet and I wanna make sure it's clean. And I'm hoping that, how much were these? Did I already say? They were $5.48 each set. I bought two and I got a dollar nine back on them. So let's see, right now they're 521. So the same thing, 521. And you can get it. I realize there's like no bottom. It's just like a, I guess it won't get moldy. You know, you won't have any problem with that. And this just goes right there. It's kind of cute. It's gonna be slick. It's gonna sit back. You're not gonna see it. It's not gonna be on the floor. All the features I liked about it. I don't know. Oh yeah, I don't know about the sticky thing. I do want it on the wall. I don't know if that's gonna hold, to be honest. I, I'm gonna have to use some of the super heavy duty 3M tape and um, just to be sure. They're super lightweight, so they're not gonna be, like be pulling down, but the container, uh, yeah, I wouldn't trust that. I'm gonna I'm gonna add more sticky, sticky tuck to it. I got two gray, gray and white, and I think it had a blue and white one. Let's see, gray and a navy blue. So the only thing with navy blue is the gray parts would be navy blue. That's the only difference. So I got that. And then I got, this is a fun pack. How about that? Okay, so I got this. Let me go back to my screen here. I got some, I wanted to try these. Have you guys tried these? Um, they're kind of privacy screens for your phone. Yeah, so this has a three piece set. So I'm thinking it's gonna be good for three pieces. Like typically, not just three pieces, but three, three phones. Protection of God? Protection of God is on there. Hmm. Crafts, Consummate Industry, Moel, the leading brand of global high-end digital accessories. And then it says Protection of God, Tamper Glass Explosion Proof. Well, that's good to know. So if I'm ever in an explosion, it's going to be proofing it. There's only a small pie shape area that can actually see when you're dead on the phone if you have these pieces on here. So it's got three of these little wipes. So I'm hoping that these are three pieces. One. Yep. It's, it's all three pieces. So I don't know what this is going to look like as a privacy screen. Oh, it's like sunglasses for your phone. <laughs> yeah. And so anybody even sitting right next to you is not going to be able to see it. So if you use those, let me know. And I will probably be giving an update on these too, because I am in meetings and sitting there and people are on their phones and I have... <laughs> I have the print so big so I can see it, but so can everybody else around me. They get to see everything I have going on. All my business. Okay. What is this, everybody? Expiration date, 5-17-26. Manufactured, only manufactured in May 18, 2023. This, oh, this is the lip sleeping mask. So I'm going to do a comparison on this. So this is um, a name brand dupe. This is the name brand dupe, and it's supposed to look just like that. I'm curious because I do buy the name brand formula of this, and I'm very curious. I'll be able to tell you what's what with this. Is this dupe accurate? Is this really worth it? This this is only two. Let me see what this this price was. I don't normally do it this way. I usually just post the prices, but I'm actually very curious myself. Two sixty nine. That is not what I paid for the name brand one. I can tell you that. I love the name brand one and it does, my gosh, it lasts a long time. And I showed it in the beauty essential haul that I just, uh, my favorite beauty essential. Th oh, look it. Oh my gosh. It, that is exactly the same thing that came with mine. West and month lip sleeping mask, Berry. So that doesn't, that's not, I mean, the, the whole container looks just like, just like um, the name brand one, but 
other than that, it doesn't have any resemblance to it. So let's give it a shot and I will be doing an update, maybe a short that shows you real quickly because we're all busy, um, how it matched up. Guys, I kind of went a little bit crazy here. Um, disposable soap slices. And this one is the orange scent one. So I think, I did get those little like tiny ones. They come in a more frosted plastic container. I guess this is frosted too, but they have like the little shapes of flowers and you really have to use probably three or four of them to even feel like you got something. But I've used slices like this before and I did like them. That's what that looks like. Still great if you need something. I mean, anything's better than not having anything. I'm not really smelling a lot of orange. I wonder if I wet, if I wet it, um, if you get more scent from it. So they're pretty thick. I've used these before from a different brand and they were pretty thin. Let me see. I was eat. it's, it's pretty thick enough that I was able to slide that back in. So how many you get? You get 50 slices in here. So that's going to be cool. I like that. I mean, I think I will. No, I have this idea. I'm not going to show you this yet because I am crazy. Oh my gosh, you guys. I must be thinking these are going to go into part of my giveaway because I bought four of them, but I, I want everybody to have them. So that's what I did. That's what I did. Okay. Have you seen this? This I got at a special deal. 57 cents. I did get two of them. So, you know, we do a lot of like spray can paint, do different things for different projects we're doing. And I saw this, I saw this hauled on that couple. I think it starts with the T double T's or something like that. Anyway, so this is supposed to go right on top of the spray can. And then by pulling this mechanism in here, it actually pushes down on the spray can dispenser. And so this attaches it tightly, like you can lift the whole thing up with the can and then just do the spray. And this way you're not getting paint on your finger or nails and it's going to be much easier to control. This is a much easier control lever than just holding it. Oh. I'm going to give that a shot for 57 cents. Heck yeah. Sold. I've seen other people haul these and I thought, you know what? Why not? These are like little portable compressed face towels. Why not? This is a pack of a hundred. That was six forty-seven for a hundred compressed disposable mini towels. So mini, how big is that? Mm, let's see how big that's going to be. That was refunded. So they're two, ah, uh, they're two eighty-four, and I did get the price adjustment credit for that. So that's good. Um, they say that these are is that the mini? Yeah. Okay. So the mini one is a six point. No, I don't know what the mini is. They're not telling me. Oh, on a hundred. Oh, that's the size of the bag. Come on, give me the size of the towel, everybody. Okay, I'm gonna have to try and insert the pil the picture later on. We're gonna have to figure that one out. You'll see it. Okay, so you know how I've been shopping on Timu and hauling purses left and right because they're so pretty. Well, I thought, and I thought also for gifts too. I do have some gift things in here. They had some cute, cute, like they're little tiny like makeup bags. I guess they're called, but that's not what I'm gonna use them for. And they have so many cute ones. So they're definitely, I'm going to pick one and they're going to go in my giveaway when I reach a thousand K in subscribers. Um, and also the reason I got them was because with my purses, my purse addiction, hello, my name is Lauren. I have not only a purse addiction, I have a team addiction. Come join me. <laughs> Let's be addicts together. Um, you know, I don't do anything else. So Anyway, so I thought these were super cute because I want to switch between my purses a lot. And I've seen years ago how people organize um, and do just that. They have like their essentials in their purses all like put into individual little bags. It's kind of squishy though. Okay, so I bought, okay, so I bought several of these bags. Again, some are going to be gifts. So that's it. Okay, so a lot of them had price reductions. They range from 179, 179. Most of them were 179 and I had a price adjustment on that one. So to maybe $2, um, totally fair. I got several of them. So here's one with the flamingos. You know what? I'm not going to open that one up because I think that's going to go in on something else. Um, yeah, they're all, they have a, like, you know what I like is they're squishy. So they definitely have some padding to them. I wonder if they all do. We're going to look at a couple of these here. So this is a floral one. I just thought this was so cute. And so it's kind of like a, like a, water resistant fabric here hopefully that's what i hope 
moisture proof, really padded. My gosh, you could use this for even um, like, like I, if I had that in my purse, I might just have my phone or technology stuff. I mean, I love the padding. I could, there's a lot of, lot of uses for this, okay? So for under $2, super cute, nice zipper, nice print. I was afraid they might be like a picture of a print and then they put it on, superimpose it on the fabric. That's not what this is. This, this looks really clear. I like the flamingo one. That is really pretty too. Okay, and of course I had to get the B one because that's been my thing this year. And then this is a pretty yellow green floral one. Again, not, oh, I love this one. Oh my gosh, I like. And then I had to get, this is the one where I thought would be just a pitcher because you've seen that when they've done that on fabric and it doesn't like they, it's too pixie, pixelated and it doesn't come out right. That's not what this is, so I'm glad. So this is the um, dandelions. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Oh. oh, and I got the pink one, like this dragonfly. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's see what we got going here with this one. We need some more color in here. That's not even all of them. Okay. Have you seen these? This was a good deal. I've bought different ones before. Now, I don't know. Hopefully they're going to smell good and it's not going to be a problem. If it's not, then they're going to get donated somewhere else. So these are five pack scented sachets for your drawers, for your closets. I got Jasmine, o Ocean, and Lavender, which were the only ones that they had. So I wanted to try them. They were only $169. Only $169, which again would be too much if you don't like it. But if you like it, what a great idea. So what I liked about it, if you're gonna use it in your closet, okay, which one is this? This is, woo. That, I like that smell, the jasmine, but you, op I'm not gonna even open it up yet. But they have like little little hangers here. Can you see that hanger? A little hanger, and then you slip it through once you take it out of the plastic. How do you go? Oh, oh, back here. So see, you pull it up through here. There's a little hole you flap, and then you stick it back down, and so they'll hang in your closet. That does smell good. It's a light, fresh, yeah, I got five of those for $169. Again, if you don't like the scent, it's not gonna be worth it, but I do like jasmine. Um, I definitely wouldn't hang more than one. <laughs> and I would put them in a sealed Ziploc bag if you don't want, because that could be a lot. That could be a lot. Okay, I do like it though. I like that one. This one is the ocean. Let's see what kind of love it gives me. If you've ever bought these things before and you have, they're not, 169 for even one of them. Now there was no overpowering scent when I opened that. This has more of a fresh soapy smell. Ocean. And it has its little hanger there, which is just loose. You just pull it out and flip it through there. You got five of those. Ocean. How come that has a different oh okay. So it just flipped around. That one might go into my closet. Okay, the more I think about it, that jasmine might be too strong for some of you. The ocean one is very light. Now lavender, this will probably go in my drawers. Five of these. I think I'm smelled out right now because the jasmine did take a big strong hold on everything. This is pretty light, it's not too bad. I think the ocean one is my favorite. If, you, if I had to rank these, it would be ocean, lavender, and the jasmine, the jasmine being the strongest scent and you may wanna stay away from it if that's not your thing. Okay, so what else did I get here? Okay, so I bought a bunch of these key rings. Again, I had the thought, Christmas stocking, Christmas gifts to go with my other stuff that I'm gonna be doing for people. This year's gonna be fun because of the existence of Timu, right? Oh, I bought these. These are, have you seen these? This is that double T site couple. These are reusable zip ties, so I wanted some for my cables and stuff that's hanging all over the place. Um, it's not a Ziploc bag, so I don't really want to open it. But there's like, these are really tiny. Um, boy, I hope I'll be able to do it. There's a little lever on there that you can just flip. That That's super tiny, you guys. What size? Do they have different sizes? There's a hundred of them in here. They don't really... Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Hopefully I won't lose these. Let's just do a little clip so I can get one out here because that's what I'm doing here. I'm reviewing my hauls with you, so I might as well test one of these and see how hard it's gonna be. Okay, so we're gonna see how hard this is to do. Yes, I have new nails on. Oh, do I have something to say about that too? 
Okay, so if you, you know, that's typical how you would use that. And then you're supposed to be able to find that little lever. There's no way. Oh, wait a second. Did I just break it? Oh, oh, okay. So there's no lever. You don't have to worry. Cause I was going to say, I'm going to throw these away after I, well, I'm going to use them, but it will just be one time. So here you go. You go like this. You can pull it like any other zip tie. It holds, it's tight. So even if I try to push it back like that now, now with a little force, you just pull it super easy. Okay. I'm glad I tried that in front of you guys so you can see, and it's reusable. So I will put that back into the bag. So these are little blackhead strips. I think they're supposed to be similar to the, the name brand that you see out there. They're a little black strip. You wet it um, and then you place it on. And when it dries, you can peel it off. And I know the name brand one works tremendously. So these were, I got two packs super you get let's see 148 much cheaper much cheaper how many do i get in that so you get 10 to a box much much cheaper that's 148 at the time which i think it is now because it's a price adjustment on there well let me get everything out of here so it's i don't normally do it this way i know it's fun to do it this way it really really is but i don't know it's noisy for one does that bother you I try not to show my address because i didn't use my privacy roller which I got from Timu. I'm one of my earlier hauls. Highly recommend that. They work great. You just have to be careful of the black ink because if you don't let it dry, man, you're gonna get that all over you. Okay, now I have some room to move. So what is this? Oh, okay, so what this is, and I've ordered one. This is, a again, from that Double T site, um, that couple. He, she picks out things, he picks out things, and they review it. Um, me. So this is something that sticks to the back of your iPad or your um, computer. Your laptop or your desktop um, or on the side because you stick this and then look at this is stretchy so if you have an external drive and I know all of us that are content creators have um, a lot of memory issues at times and I don't mean just like I can't remember something I mean like space and capacity on those devices so you have to get an external drive and so this will hold it and that way you have it so compact and right there and you can save to it. You don't have this extra device taking up space on your desk. So he showed this and I was like, okay, I'm getting that because, um, and I like how stretchy this is. So it will fit almost any size item that you have or device you have. So I figure also I could put my cord in there. I could put my, um, uh, just anything you might need a block. He showed it, it held a lot. So the, mostly he was using it for his external drive to his laptop. And, um, you know, when you're having a lot of photos taken or you're doing a lot of videos, it's very memory impacting on your devices. So you might need an external drive to get through those moments and that would hold it very nicely. Okay. So I did buy a couple of, Oh, this is cute. I love spoons. <laughs> Let me just start with that. I love spoons. I love tiny spoons. I love spoons for my tea. I've shown you stuff that I've bought before, um, early, early on in my Timu career, <laughs> which I think has only been a couple months. Um, and I love, I love, I love it. I don't know. I like mini things. I like all that kind of stuff. So this was a set and this will be great for like iced teas also. It's a set of four, um, like coffee or even ice cream. And I got the golden, I think they come in silver and it's 178, 178 for these four. So I'm going to take them out. They come in a set here. They're all wrapped. I'm not going to show you the front yet until I take them out of here. So these are super cute. You guys, let's see here. There's like a rose one and I just want to go. Yeah. So they have two different size or one size and it comes gold or silver. So you could get this in like the stainless steel. They are stainless steel and they're great for stirring. Or like they said, ice cream. Um, so that's one. Let's open up. We're going to open them all up. Because I love these. Um, a heart. I'm always putting hearts. I love hearts. And then here's another flower. And yet another design. These are super cute, you guys. And they have no markings on the back, but the handle does have like a leafy kind of, they're really pretty and they're super long. Let's see if I can tell you how long they are. They're really thin. Um, so they're dainty. That's what I would call it. I don't care. They're pretty. I like them. So they're, um, the whole length of them are 7.28 inches. Okay. And the, the face of it is about 1.1 inch. And... There you go. My favorite new spoons. 
Those are cute, you guys. Oh, can you see it now? So if you have a channel and you do videos, you have content, and you let me know below in the comment field, I will come to your page. I will check it out and I will support you because I think that's how we all grow. We have to support one another. Oh my gosh, wait till you see this. So just let me know in the comment field below and I'll be happy to do that. And of course, I hope you'll come back to my channel too. So this is a chunky slice chain. It says gold plated, but I got the silver. Um, it's 30 inches, 89 cents. I wanted a longer chain. This is pretty, you guys, very pretty. Ooh, where's my little hand? I gotta get that. That's pretty, huh? I don't think I'll be able to put any charm on it because it is chunky. But that's what I wanted. I wanted a chunky one. A chunky and I wanted it long. So yeah, that's long. Okay. And then I got the same one in gold. And that again, that's 89 cents right now. What did I pay? Yeah, I paid 89 cents too. So I got I got this in the gold. Now the gold kind of looks well, actually it does look like gold. It's a yellow gold. Yellow gold right there. Okay, so a few more items here now. <laughs> I love purses, I do, and I can't get enough, especially with all the quality that I've been seeing on the ones I've purchased through Timu. And I thought these would be so cute, especially to give as a gift or um, in, in addition to it. But I bought all these little key rings. Oh my gosh. So let's just start with the cat. So the cat ones came super um, in form, not smashed down at all. These were less than 187. They were, uh, well, I got quite a bit of credit back on that one. Um, well, let's see what they are right now. 179. So, and they come in so many different colors. I got the navy blue. That's a navy blue one. And I bought the pink one too. And they have gold fixtures. Um, they're snap closures. And like I said, these, this one's pretty thick right here. They all work. Um, I didn't have to like form them again. Everything. It's just really pretty. It's super pretty. Super cute. I just thought a great little accent to a gift that you're giving. And they have, all of them have the alligator uh, claw right there. So you can just click it on to another purse, another thing. I don't know how tight that's going to be, though. Let me see. Um, yeah. And then they also have the ring, the traditional key ring portion there. So I got those two. This one came smashed. I did stuff it. I'm hoping that it's going to get a shape, but I loved it. It's a green. And this, again, was about... None of these are more than $2. I tried to stay around the 150 The ones I just showed you were a little bit... Um, right there and so this one here this was 198 but it, I did get a partial refund on it so that one is it's getting hot in here right now um, currently 189 look how cute that little purse is and it has silver fixtures to it and this does snap I have it I have it stuffed with the wrapper that it came in right now um, how cute is that very cute huh and then let's show you close up of all I'm gonna say my favorite well I'm gonna say my favorite one the last I, I mean I love them all so I just don't know this one here this one was smashed I have it shoved I have a, it's stuffed right now to get it shaped back but it's super cute these are gold um, fixtures to it same alligator clip there and the regular traditional key ring circle um, this was 147 but it did have a price adjustment so again you'll see it's 122 and they come in various colors too. that one and then I got this one this is the faux leather mini handbag key ring and it was 148 when I purchased it again it's come down in price since then with gold fixtures and you'll see the price down below they all snap this one is one of my favorite ones this is the pink square decorative small bag key ring 147 it's probably the least amount that I paid and it has gold fixtures but I just love the style to it <laughs> same ring it's just cute huh and it came flat but it as soon as I I would say that this little um, snap is a little tough, but it doesn't snap, and then you pull it up like that. Faux leather. I have the plastic in there that I, but yeah, I mean, you could carry your ear pods in here, um, your Aldi quarter uh, token. Um, we don't have Aldi's out here. I've lived where they had them, so I do like them, but I don't need it for that. But oh my gosh, if you like purses, how cute are these? Super cute. Okay, so couple more things to show you here. Man, I had a lot of items in this haul. This might get broken up into two. So, the, these were shown, I think it was Twisted Gypsy that showed these on her channel. So I went and um, they're color eyeliners and I don't normally wear eyeliners, but I do like a little sparkle. As if you, any of you check her out, she likes a little sparkle. So, um, but basically I got like this copper one. I got a little sparkle in it and then I got uh, one that is a little bit darker. So I got color 15, color 16, and color three. 
Um, ooh, this is more red than I thought it would be. So to see the difference, one is lighter than the other. And now I just mixed them up. So let's see, color 16 here. Okay. Yep. And then here's color three, which I think is a silvery. Silver, so good for holidays, good for a party. Good for a little sparkle on top of it. Yeah. So if you know if they're a dupe for anything, let me know. But I thought these were super pretty and I want to try those. And it's all gonna depend on me how fast they dry if I like them. Because if they stay wet a long time with my hooded eyelids, there's no way it's ever gonna dry. And then I got this. My friend had, she got one free off of Fishland and she said it was awesome. So I had to put it in my cart and it's 587. So, you know, it's a rechargeable portable lint remover from pillows or whatever you have that might have lint. So in here is a little brush to clean it out, little directions. Um, oh, English, uh, French, Dutch, Italian, Spanish on one side. You guys, there's, there's only those four languages. Interesting. This device complies with part 15 of the FCC rule. Okay, so I had to get, you know, of course, because I love these colors, like a rose gold. It just looks tan. It's not like sparkly like rose gold. So my experience is with, let me see. So I guess this little area here is where the lint is collected into, and then you would just clean that out. Just wanna make sure it's not returned and somebody else had used them. But my experience with anything that's rechargeable, is it comes with a, enough charge for you to try it. Let's see, is there anything here? I don't know if this will, I don't want to damage my, oh my goodness. I don't really have any lint on here, but cool. Okay, that's 587 everybody. I'm gonna pause this and come right back with the two big things that I wanted to show you. So have you seen these? folding storage boxes. I know there's a couple variations with some with the double doors that open. I like this one. I didn't get that type. This is a medium size. It comes small, medium, large, and these do get a little pricey, but I, I told you I ordered one already. I've already had one in use and they are worth it. So they're $31.98. It's probably the most costly thing I've spent on Timu, but I love them and they're stackable. And let me tell you about this. So I'm going to open it up and you're going to see. Now, I got the medium pearl white, and I do like that color, and that's why I went with it again. They're super easy to assemble. It comes with that styrofoam. Um, actually, these are marked down. Well, that's the small size. Let me see if the medium is, is on sale. No, they're still $31.98. Okay, so I'm gonna take it out of the wrapper here. Everything is together. And that's how it looks when you first take it out of the wrapper. So this piece right here, that's going to be ultimately the lid and it's smoky. I like that. I do like it a lot. What I liked about these, and I don't know if the other ones come with it or not, they do all have working wheels and they're not casters. They don't go all over, but they work. They are very smooth moving. So what I'm doing right here is, I don't know if you can see, I'm flipping this up and I'm going to show you this in a second. In the middle here is another piece to do that. Um, I think on my other one, I had the other ring. Oh, it's, oh, it's already in. Okay. I was getting nervous there because I know that's happened to other people, but I didn't want it to happen to me. Um, so this is the only piece you have to assemble on top of here because all the other sides are already together. So you just lay it down and you snap it on that bar and it will work there. It's, I just laid it down and just lifted it up, but I didn't get that last one in. Okay, you don't have to press really. You just lay it down there. They all snap in there. So now I have all four pieces, all four sides, I should say, kind of like this. I can't show you right now, but I'm going to show you in a second. Okay, so that's gonna lay down in a second. I can't get that to stay up. So in the lid, if you do like I did and think it wasn't here, it's here. You wanna take this piece out, it's locked in. So you wanna unlock this. And now you can get this piece out because this piece is what's going to hold the top sides all together like this. 
And once you line it up, you're going to snap this down and then it won't come off unless you want it to come off, which I don't. It takes me a second to line this all up because of course it would go a lot easier if I wasn't on camera trying to do this, but you know, that's how life is. <laughs> it never works when I'm on camera. Have you all seen the chopper episode, my kitchen finds and my demo? I wasn't as quick on that as I am on this, so trust me. I can't believe I did that on that d demo, but as you saw on that video, I got better. I got better at it. Okay, so this all slides down. So that's good. So now I have a case here, okay? Now, this just lays on top. They're stackable, and then you would just see these two little levers here. You would just click, and they're super easy to click. And now that lid is locked into place. Now, the other feature on this box that I really like, let me see if I can get, is that every side, so no matter how you're storing these or stacking these or using them, you're gonna be able to open it up from whatever angle works better for you. And I can't do it for the one hand. So you wanna make sure you unlock each side and then that will fall down. And then you can get into the space. And then to lock it, if you don't click that, it will just flop back down. Same with every side. a banana to help me when I do this. Um, so I think these are some of the best storage con containers I have ever found in my life. Um, we use a lot of those tubs. It is a little smaller. They do have a size larger than this. I can give you the dimensions and they come in like orange, a green, this pearl white, a light green, a yellow, all these other colors. Um, so the small one is 15 inches, 15 inches across. Um, 11 by 11.10 inches and then the depth is 9.13 inches for the small one this is a medium so this is 18.11 inches across um, width is 1378 13 inches and 78 and the height is the same it's 9.45 um, actually it's taller than the small one the small one was 19.13 okay then the large one is 19 inches, 0.76, 19.76 inches, long way. Um, this side, it's 13.97, and then its height is 11.22 inches. So they have all these different ranges. These are great for everything. Uh, you know, I think, and then the wheels alone are going to be awesome, and that they're stackable. So I like that you can open it up. You can even set it like this if you wanted to and have this as your door. Um, whatever you decide, they're super flexible as far as how you're going to utilize them. And I do, I do agree they're a little costly, but if you have some credits or some coupons, that's the time I would make that purchase because these are worth every penny. I haven't had a problem with it. The other one that I bought and I couldn't be happier about that. So that's my Timu haul. Um, if you like this video, hit the like button. And if you haven't subscribed before, think about it. I invite you to do that now and just hit the little bell next to it and you'll be notified when I have new videos go up. And tell a friend. Use my code. It's FAV70814. I'm also an influencer, although today's haul was all purchased by me. And in the future, I do have a big um, uh, influencing uh, promotion where I have a bunch of items I ordered at my choice and I will give honest reviews on them. So. Have a great day and thank you for staying this long and thank you for watching and thank you for coming by. Appreciate it.